Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the beta channel of the Windows Insider program, which is the build 22621.160. Remember a few builds ago, I told you that the tabs and also the new navigation pane from the dev channel will not be available in Windows 11 22H2. Well, Microsoft proved me wrong and they released an update, a small update for the beta channel, basically Windows 11 22H2, in which they include included the tabs in the file explorer and also the new navigation pane. Of course, if you are on the beta channel, all you need to do is to search for updates in the settings app, go to Windows Update and just click on check for updates and you should receive this latest Windows 11 update for the beta channel. Another thing that needs to be said about this new update is that the tabs and also the new navigation pane are not available for every Windows Insider. So what I'm thinking is that Microsoft will still work on the tabs and also on the new navigation pane and until Windows Windows 11 22H2 is officially released, they will have a very stable and well-developed version of the tabs and also the navigation pane. So before showing you how to enable the tabs and also the navigation pane and talk about anything else that you can find in this build, please don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. Of course, as I've said, these new features on the better channel are not available for every Windows Insider, but you can manually enable them using Vive tool. Of course, I've done a video before and also a special article regarding this, but I'm going to show it again in this video and you'll have a link in the description down below where you'll be able to find full information on how to do that if somehow I go through it way too fast in this video. So you're going to need Vive tool. As I've said, the link will be in the article down below in the description, the download link and also the commands that I'm going to use in this video. Just go on the download link for Vive tool, download the latest version.zip, open it, going to use the default Windows 11 extracting tool, click on extract all, select the location by clicking on browse this PC, local disk C, Windows, then scroll down to system 32, select system 32 and then click on select folder and then click on extract continue and also continue to extract the necessary files. Now all you need to do is to open up the search box, type in here CMD, right click on CMD and then click on run as administrator and on user account control click on yes. In CMD you're going to have to paste in two commands. The two commands will be in the article down below in the description. Just copy and paste them here. Copy and paste, enter, should receive successfully set feature configuration and the same thing for the second command, paste it, successfully set feature configuration. Now all you need to do is to restart the operating system for the changes to take effect and you will have the tabs and also the new navigation pane in file explorer in windows 11 beta or 22 h2 click on restart now after the restart if you go into the file explorer you will notice that you will have the new tabs and also the new navigation pane in file explorer which actually looks really good of course i'm not going to talk about this in depth you can just test it out if you want but briefly you can switch between tabs of course you can rearrange them you have a few options if you right click on a certain tab and so on. If you want to see a full demonstration and also a full tutorial on this, the links will be in the description down below. Now, as I've said, this build for the beta channel is a small one. Basically, everything that is new is this new feature with the tabs and also the new navigation pane. But we also have a known issue, which is regarding the file explorer. And basically, that known issue is that the up arrow is misaligned in file explorer tabs. This will be fixed in a future update. I think they're talking about this arrow. As you can see, it is misaligned, but I don't think that's a really big big issue it's only a visual design issue so we shouldn't be bugged really much about this but basically this is great news as i've said tabs and also the new navigation pane in file explorer should be coming in windows 11 22 h2 as well maybe this means that windows 11 22 h2 it's going to take some time until it's released maybe a month or two but if we have to wait for the tabs and also the new navigation pane i think it is worth it so if you want to test this out and you are on the better channel make sure to install this new update don't forget that all the links necessary will be in the article down below and also other links in the description regarding the tabs and so on. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.